the whole world is forgiven, but the whole world is not saved. Not until you receive God's gift of the everlasting life. What is that gift? It's the Holy Spirit dwelling within you, resurrecting your dead spirit inherited from Adam. How do I receive everlasting life? Repent of unbelief by believing in the death, burial, and resurrection of the Lord Jesus Christ. God's Son, God in flesh, who came to take away the sin of the world. Jesus was fully God and fully man. God cannot die, but Jesus did die because of his being human as well as divine. The good news is that Jesus rose from the dead for your justification. That means completely justified in God's sight. You, you receive new life, God's spirit, when you believe the gospel and trust Jesus by having faith in his blood. This is all done by God, not man. There are no works or rituals of any kind required. Just simple belief, faith, and trust in what God did for you. Trust in God's righteousness. Enjoy peace with God by staying away from all religion and ministers of righteousness, those who preach self-righteousness. Our righteousness is imputed by God through believing in and on the Lord Jesus Christ and not by anything we do or don't do. I pray that this message will sink deep into your heart and bring you peace, peace that surpasses all understanding. Begin to experience God's love, his unconditional love for you and for all mankind. Check out uh, the videos I've been uploading by Aaron Budgen and renew your mind, Re refresh your spirit, and trust fully in God. He, he's done it all. <laughs> this is his plan. And once you really believe it, understand it, and believe it, you will have peace that you have never known. So, huh. let's set the captives free. God bless you all, in Jesus' name.